Aquarius and welcome back to my channel and this is your February 2022 reading from anything spiritual. Firstly I'd like to say a big thank you for the likes and subscribes and the support that my channel receives. In the description below I'll put a link to my sister's channel Mind Sign Inspiration. She also releases monthly videos and remember if you like these videos please subscribe, comment, like. It always helps the momentum of my channel. Okay Aquarius, I was asking what the month ahead holds for you and remember this is a Valentine month so I will be pulling some love and relationship cards at the end but I always do pull love and relationship cards anyway but I just thought I'd mention it with it being Valentine's. So I was asking what the month ahead holds for you and you had two cards fall out. You had the Two of Swords and the Four of Pentacles. With the Two of Swords is about struggling to make a decision. You're trying to be impartial, you're trying to please everybody. And the Four of Pentacles, it's sort of about, he's sitting there, he's holding on to his money, he looks a bit stuck, you know, he looks a bit paused. So to me, I did feel your message was stuck on a decision, trying to please everyone. So we're going to pull some more cards here for you, Aquarius, and see what else the month of February holds for you. We have some more cards for Aquarius, please. More cards for Aquarius for February. Okay, Aquarius, what we can see already, you've come out, you've got the Nine of Wands, the Empress, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Devil. So the Nine of Wands here, you can see this person's working hard, getting everything, they're organised, everything in a row. And next to the Empress card there, now she is the homemaker. She likes to get everything sorted. Can you imagine, you know, when um, people say they're having a baby, then they start getting their... Um, nest ready as they say and you know they get all the house organized and that sort of thing that's the empress the homemaker the family person getting it all organized getting everything straight and the same here with this sort of nine of ones so this is what's going on with you you want to get everything organized you want to get everything straight you want to get your foundation sorted and again there with that queen of pentacles you know pentacles is an earth sign the earth sign they're really grounded people they like to have stability so this is what you're aiming for this is what you want this is what you quite possibly have at the moment but it looks like there's going to be a change it looks like some sort of problem that occurs regularly for you because you've got the devil card so whatever your devil is um it's going to create you some problems because when we look down below we've got the tower card we've got changes we've got a struggle we've got feeling trapped so it looks like you know, you, you start off the month here having everything organised, having everything straight and you think, brilliant, here I am, I'm all sorted. And then along comes something, along comes a problem that you're tied to, that you can't get away with. Here we go again, that problem again. Let's pull a light seer's tarot and see if it can tell us a bit more about what this devil is. Okay, is it work? Have the temperance has come out? So is it you? trying to do everything for everybody else is it you not keeping things in balance just when you think things are right things go out skittled again is it external forces that create your own balance but there seems to be an unbalance coming along and this seems to be the thing that creates you problems just when you've got organized just when you get sorted along comes something to change it now the pages they're normally good messages they're normally good news but it's to do with this card here it's to do with the tower so yeah the tower card isn't really a very nice card but it's it's sort of saying there's good news so this change has to happen okay your foundations have to be changed your foundations have to be rocked so yes you've got all sorted you've got your foundations um organized but there has to be a change and you're going to struggle for that make that change because we've got that five of wands and five is fives are about instability and they are about changes so yes there's going to be some instability and some changes that's going to rock your foundations where you're all organized and sorted and you're not going to feel very happy about it you're going to feel like this has happened to you so it's almost to me like you didn't want this change Aquarius it's almost happened to you it's almost a case that 
you know, it's some sort of external force that, that comes along. And it's to do with a new start. We've got the full card here. So wherever there's a new start, something new coming for you, or this change could create a new start. But it looks like there's a definite change coming for you in the month of February. And remember your message at the beginning about being stuck on a decision and trying to please everyone. So you're not gonna please everyone, Aquarius, because this change has to happen and it looks like it's probably you that's not gonna be too happy about it. But there is a change that has to happen. And you know, it's about a new start. And changes when they come along, yes, we don't like them, but sometimes it's the universe saying, you know, this is meant to be, this is for you. So let's have a look what your guardian angels say for you. And you've got the four of thoughts. Spend time in nature listening for guidance from your angels and your own inner voice because overanalyzing the situation won't provide the answers you're seeking. Consider taking a vacation or a small break to help you rejuvenate and become clear on what your next step should be. Meditation can be very helpful. So you're going to have a lot going on in your mind. This is that eight of swords and it's telling you that when this happens, meditate, clear your mind, have a little break. This change is going to happen. There's no escape in it, but don't overthink it Aquarius, okay? Don't overthink the changes. Don't get into this um, eight of swords mode because the changes are going to happen it's going to happen your foundations are going to be rocked in the month of um february there's going to be some sort of change you're going to overthink it you're not going to be very happy and that was the message we said at the beginning trying to please everyone you're probably going this change has to happen because somebody else wants it to happen because i don't think it's you aquarius you're not very happy about it Okay, now let's pull some love and relationship cards and remember um, your year ahead readings. All right, now these cards are just jumping out all over here. Your year ahead is already out. I'll attach that to the end as an end screen. So if you're um, new to my channel, then uh, please watch the your year ahead as well. And let's hope that resonates with you. And like I say, um, remember to subscribe, like and comment. Okay, let's have a couple of love and relationship cards for Aquarius. These are general readings. For some of you, it may already have resonated in your love life. For some of you, it may be friends, family, work. And you've got give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership and free yourself. Take back control of your life. Okay, so if you're feeling, as we said before, that something's being done to you, so it's taking back control, trying to give relationship a chance and working on partnerships, but freeing yourself from any control. So remember, communicate, Aquarius. Tell people if you feel that you're being railroaded into something, but there is definitely some sort of change that you're not going to like going on in your life. It may not be relationships, but obviously where your relationships are, you do need to work on those partnerships and you do need to um, have some time to take back control of your life because you know partnerships remember are a 50 50 thing so you don't want to feel that you are being controlled Aquarius and for those of you who are single you just need to try and work on partnerships it may be that there's a relationship there that you're not really interested in or you're not giving it a chance okay so where that may be um, in there for you it may be that uh, somebody's interested but you've not even you know gone on a date or sort of communicated with them it may be that you need to give a try there and again if you're single free yourself from any sort of control so you can free yourself and be available for a relationship okay Aquarius I hope you've enjoyed your reading it looks like you've got a busy month thank you for watching and I'll see you again soon